Darling, I'm back. Honey? Where did you go? Mm, I know you didn't leave the room. There's no place to go. Maybe you're... Under here? Nope, not under the bed. How about... In here? Nope, not in the bathroom either. I wonder... Where... You... Can be... Gotcha! Quit struggling, my love. It won't do you any good. And you'll ruin your tuxedo. You'd upset me if you did something foolish like that. Well, your cuffs seem to have held well, but I may have to add some further restraints for good measure, of course. But we'll have to do something about your gag. It's sopping wet. No worries. I plan for this. Hi, Federa. Yes, he he did try to escape again. Yes, please, extra change and some straps to secure him to the dolly would be nice. Oh, can you even imagine him struggling when we transported him to the altar? <laughs> My dear boy will need a fresh gag, too. His is currently soaked in drool, and I want him looking his best. And not his wettest. <laughs> oh, one more thing. Bring Miranda and the muzzle. You can't be too cautious, right? Thanks, darling. See you two in a few minutes. <sighs> you simply couldn't resist, could you? You know it enrages me when you do things like this, and I don't want to be like that on my wedding day. I'm afraid you won't like it if it was. Imagine what would have happened if you weren't locked in those shackles. You might have tried to kill me again. I guess it's a good plan to make sure you're tightly secured at all times. No more wedding day arguments out of you, my pet. Now, sit tight until they arrive. My big day has arrived, and I know you can't wait either. Mm. Yes, I have to take precautions. You understand, right? <laughs> of course you do. Oh, honey, I wish you could see the glare you're giving me right now to mask your fear. It's absolutely priceless. Come in. Thanks for getting here so quickly. Let's get these chains on him first. Now, if you struggle, you're just going to lower your energy. And they won't give you cake. So don't struggle. There. That should hold you nicely. Yes, Phaedra. He does look ravishing in those chains, doesn't he? Strap him to the dolly before replacing his gag. <laughs> yes, I agree. Did you bring the leather straps? Ooh, yes, those will be nicely. Oh, lovely. My little groom can't squirm an inch. Now let's change that gag for you. I know you need a break from it even for a brief second. Miranda, untie his gag. Phaedra, make sure his mouth is open. I will replace the gag back into his mouth. On three. Two. One. Go, 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 go. There. Now I'll tightly truss and gag like a good groom. But there was no sense in fighting back. It was three against one. You know you didn't stand a chance. Anyways, one last chest for safety. The muzzle. 
I can't have you whimpering during my special day. Oh my gosh, you look divine. I might have to keep you like this always. No, need to shake your head, no. I can see that you like it. How about this? If you don't like it, simply tell me you don't like it and want to be let go and let you go. Simple, right? Now say you want me to let you go. Nothing? See, I knew you liked this. You're speechless. Oh, right, it's time for the ceremony. Let's get it in place at the altar. And here we are. Get him secured to the altar, lock his chains in place, and stand behind him, in case he tries something stupid. You won't try anything stupid, will you? <laughs> Everything has been planned. The pastor works for me, the guests are my own, and everyone knows what's going on here, so don't even try anything. If you do, I will be very upset with you. Don't make me do something I might regret. Good boy. Let's get him in position and get this wedding started. Once he's secured to his knees, at the altar, cue the music, and I'll walk down the aisle. <laughs> well, that went smoother than I thought. We're, we're married. Can you believe it, honey? Or, I guess, rather, husband. We're finally married. No objections. Not like you could anyway, right? I knew gagging me was a smart idea. However, you did not when I asked if you would take me until death do us part. Hmm. I know you're speechless at all this, so I'll be happy with both of us. You don't mind, do you? You just stay there looking like your best self, all tied up and gagged for me. We'll take some pictures and I can whisk you away to our honeymoon. You're gonna love it. It will give me some time to get you used to what will be expected of you. And what your new life will be like. Isn't that wonderful? Aww, you're happy too. I can see your tears flowing. Now let's get you prepped and ready for transport to our new life together. I love you, my darling, darling husband. <laughs> Please like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.